Welcome to the American Rambler with your host, Paul Grofton. Uh, hey, I was trying to get back into the habit of posting a podcast and I wanted to get monetized and I found on Facebook somebody that was selling an old channel that was monetized prior to the requirements. Now, the person's name had actually multiple names. Amber Hader, Mohammed Kashif, and Dilshad Ahmed. And of course, why am I not broadcasting on the new channel? Well, as you can expect, I got ripped off. So I am posting what happened here, but don't worry, I've also contacted my bank uh, to file a dispute. So here's my review of um, the, uh, what happened. Are you tired of dealing with unprofessional sellers and unhelpful customer support? Look no farther than the disappointing experience I had with a Fiverr seller named Mohammed Kashif and the lack of assistance from Satapay. I recently purchased a YouTube channel for Mohammed Kashif also known as Dilsad Ahmed, uh, expecting a smooth transition and a prompt transfer of ownership. However, to my dismay, he refused to fill his end of the agreement by withholding the channel from me. Despite my attempts to reason with him, Mohammed Kasif, also known as Amber Hader, has shown a complete disregard for ethical business practices. His refusal to transfer the channel not only violates our agreement, but also demonstrates a lack of integrity. To make matters worse, Satape, the platform through which the transaction was conducted, has been unresponsive and unhelpful in resolving this issue. Despite reaching out multiple times for assistance, they have, provi they have failed to provide any meaningful support or intervention. It is deeply frustrating to encounter such dishonesty and a lack of accountability in both the seller and the platform facilitating the transaction as a consumer it is essential to be cautious when engaging with individuals like Mohammed Kashif on platforms like Satape. Uh, I'm tired of dealing with unprofessional and unhelpful customer support. Okay. Uh, in conclusion, it's been my experience with Mohammed Kashif a.k.a. Amber Hader, a.k.a. Dilset Ahmed, uh, as a seller um, payment platform has been nothing short of disappointing. I urge others to exercise caution when dealing with them to avoid similar frustrations and poten potential financial losses. Now, I want to make sure you know that it was my choice, I mean, not my choice, but I did go off Fiverr Platform. However, Fiverr Platform has been magnanimous and did try to solve the issue. As a result, though, with the non-issue, they have banned Dilsad Ahmed from their own platform. However, Satape has failed to... Uh, fulfill the end of the bargain and is still having the account open.